Five tech companies held an innovation session at MRO Europe in London to showcase the value of innovations within aviation and the benefits of tech collaboration in the MRO industry. Last year on MRO Europe in Amsterdam, I was hunting innovations since I'm an innovation manager and I um, came across a few innovations because you still have to hunt for them. Uh, one of them was dent and buckle and I said, well, uh, why don't, uh, are we able to work together? And, oh, yeah, we're open to that. And then we came and thought, why don't we do a, an, a session together? Maybe in other few other companies. So we are a joint voice, basically, explaining how we can use innovation today and not just conceptual in the future, but today. And this is basically the starting point from Denton Buckle came in, Blue Bear, Output, then I met uh, A3 in Dubai and asked them to come along. And this is a starting point with five companies and maybe more to come. So all uh, five companies today uh, have been actively involved. We're very passionate independently about aviation and problems in aviation. And so we were addressing different pieces of a much larger puzzle and happened to come across at industry trade events and realized that uh, perhaps getting together and speaking as a unified voice to the industry might actually open up eyes towards aviation innovation that can happen today. It's really uh, five companies that have a, a sort of a common passion around a much larger problem, even though we are attacking different uh, aspects of the problem independently. Um, and that's, that's our vision behind it. Now, if, if the industry comes to us and a particular airline or an MRO says, hey, we would like to implement, you know, three out of five or all five of these individual solutions into a seamless flow, I think everyone uh, at the table would obviously be very willing to work with them. But our coming together is really designed around building awareness in the industry that the term innovation doesn't have to mean something distant and future. It's already happening and we're trying to trying to show them how, how to embrace it. The thing is, the big companies are looking to the big vendors. So I think it, it, it really takes courage or boldness to embrace smaller companies to start working in an agile way that really helps them to benefit. The other thing is really looking around and everyone everyone is waiting for someone else to be the first mover, right? And so uh, finding finding the, the leaders in the industry that are willing to step out and actually uh, embrace innovation is, is the other challenge. The bottom line as we understand it from the MRO industry is it's all about keeping planes in the sky. Right? and minimizing ground time. Uh, and where we come in is, uh, as you've probably seen through the discussions today, is all about improving efficiency at every stage, whether it's assessment of damage, whether it's uh, deriving more meaningful information out of data. It's all about improving turnaround time, adding intelligence to the, to the existing workflow. And that's how all five of these seemingly disparate solutions uh, are really unified. They're addressing the problem of improving efficiency. Thank <laughs> you.